You remember when I was talking about the lemon rind and the lemon pith and the fruit part? This is the fruit itself. These are the seeds, obvious. This green part, this is the lemon rind. And then this white part, this is the lemon pith. Now this is what is bitter, both for the lemon and the oranges actually. And this is the, cito, the, the, the sweet part. So my point is, you see the same process, we are making lemonade. That is the same way you ought to make orangeade. So once you've mastered the art of making this, you can use the same idea to make your uh, orangeade. When life throws you lemons, you make lemonade. Lemonade time! Guys, today we're making lemonade. Lemonade! Okay, uh, lemons are very healthy. This is something that I learned from Dr. Anna. So, one very important thing that you should know Lemons are anti-cancer, they are very rich in vitamins and they have so many benefits. So I would just like to show you how to prepare something very simple that you can take at any time of the day, however much you like. It's very simple, you use very few lemons and the end product, believe you me, is just perfect. So for the ingredients we have the lemons, uh, we have sugar. There is cinnamon and water, just that. So guys, remember, clean hands, clean fruits, point number one. Then, I would like to get the lemon ring. Now, the lemon has the fruit part, the one that has the juice. Then there's the pith, then there's the ring. So when you're grating, you have to make sure you grate the rind only. If you happen to get the pith, then your juice will be a bit bitter. So I'll grate it in this water. So notice I'm grating, but I'm not getting to the white part. When you're done with the green part, the next part you get is the green one. And that is what is called the pith. That is the bitter part. So just remove the rind only. It's green in color. You eat as much as you can. That is how I'm getting it. I am not getting to the white part. Actually, if you happen to get the pith, you will not enjoy this juice. Because it, it is as bitter as bile. <laughs> for lack of a better example you can get as much as you like mm. so this is enough ring So that is how your lemons should look like when you're done with the ring. This is how your water should look like. The water with the ring. Our lemon ring water is almost boiling. So when it's almost boiling, we'll add the flavor. This is cinnamon. Cinnamon just adds flavor 
and smell a bit of smell then i'll add sugar so that it dissolves in the in the hot water so i'm adding about five spoons because of the amount of water but it depends for me this is about one liter of water so i'm going to add five spoons this tablespoons so one two three four five points to note i'm not a sugar person i don't like a lot of sugar so i'm not saying that this is the uh, limited amount of sugar you should add if you don't find it as sweet as possible you can add some more but don't overdo it and don't underdo it okay so remember how we said if you want to get more juice from your fruit your lemons you roll them so we'll roll cut and squeeze the juice so I'll squeeze my juice in this glass get as much juice as possible my lemon rind cinnamon water is boiling and this is all the three lemons what we have left after pressing the juice and this is the match juice we've gotten from the three lemons once your water has cooled, you'll we'll save it. Notice how dark my juice is. This is because of the cinnamon. If you want yours to be a bit light or some somewhat greenish or like this color, you can just skip the cinnamon. But I love the cinnamon because it also has many benefits to the body. Next, you take this juice, the juice that we sieved from the lemons then you'll add it you see it's changed the water a bit if you noted from dark brown to light brown that's the effect that lemon has okay so this is what we have then I'll just add some ice cubes just to get it more chilled. These are also optional. And then you just you can use a lemon for the garnish. So you can just have them directly. Thank you so much for watching. This has been Rinse Chef in Rinse Kitchen, a Rinse production. Don't forget to like, don't forget to share. Please subscribe. Till next time. Bye bye.